it's going to be a longer version of No Laughing Matter. You used to do, watch it on a Friday night. It used to be about, what, five minutes long? Now it's going to be half hour, and it premieres on Sunday night from 7.30 p.m., and it's got Akash Samaru's stamp on it. Uh, he is going to be phenomenal on that show in many ways because that's really Akash's yeah, person. Let me, let me just, let me just kind of, let me just kind of stop you right there. How are you going, Ryan? I just want to borrow your show for a little bit, just for a minute, right? Hi, I'm Akash Samaru. You may remember me from such classics as Oh gosh, Akash, I just answered that. And why is he in this press briefing? With everything going on, you're probably asking yourself, what else could 2020 possibly have in store? Well, me. That's right, No Laughing Matter is coming back on Sunday nights at 7.30 p.m. Just about the time you're ironing your clothes for work and trying to figure out if you really need that job. You do. Anyhow, I'll be there Sunday nights and I've brought a friend as well. You've seen his videos, you've enjoyed his comedy. Now Kwame Weeks will be joining No Laughing Matter. So join me, let's talk No Laughing Matter every Sunday night at 7.30 p.m. only on CNC3. Thank you, Ryan. You can have back your show. Oh, oh, oh. I'll borrow this guy. Well, 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 while we have you here, while we have you here, please stay. Uh, no Laughing Matter was a huge hit. Let me just ask you a few questions as you hear. No Laughing Matter was a huge hit when it was very summary, it was very short. Now it's expanded into half hour. I mean, th that's, that's incredible congratulations by the way uh, thank you yeah we realized that um, a lot of people like to consume their news that way I, I didn't think it would have been such a it would have resonated with people as much when I started it back in 2018 you'd remember yeah every Friday, Friday night. night yeah and um, for some reason all nine years of journalism I had was became secondary because that's all everybody wanted to talk about when you come back with no laughing matter what's going on with no laughing matter and it took a little while to come back, but it, the, the idea was fit to always be something bigger than it was. And you know Nicholas Nicola Samga is, all right? So he was behind great me. Great guy, for, great guy. I love him. He was behind me for an entire year when we were going to get this up. But it, you would know, a show like that takes some courage. Yeah. It takes a different mindset. Mm -hmm. It's different from the average journalism that we do. So I really needed 2019 to do that introspection is this where I want to go with, with, with my career? And I realized that um, as much as I try to hide it, I can't help myself. You've seen it. <laughs> You've seen it. I can't help myself. There, there, there is a way that I report the news, and I thought, well... It's you. Yeah, it's me. It's, it's real, and, you know, we, we can only do so much in one minute, 30 seconds. Yeah. And now with half an hour, the possibilities are boundless. Are you, are you a little bit nervous heading into very, this? Very, very, very. But, you know, coming out of um, that, that COVID-19, where I was, uh, a, you know, a, a usual meme <laughs> every day, it kind of built up my, my tolerance right. for, it, for, for the criticism because sometimes the truth offends when it comes to politics and people are very loyal to their party. How dare you question anything? So I realized it's, it's the job in Orion, you, you experience it as well. You know, people criticize, well, why are you asking that? Well, that's my job. My job is to ask that. True. I want to bring in to now, Kwame is actually here with us as well. Hey, Kwame. Uh, and and uh, since you're co-hosting the show with me for this particular segment, you can ask questions as well. Kwame, how are you doing this morning? Thank you very much for joining us. I hope that Kwame is hearing us. I don't think he is, but we will try to get back Kwame uh, via Zoom this morning. He'll be co-hosting with you. Tell us, uh, uh, tell us about the structure of this show. Well, right, so as you know that the first five minutes was a, a recap of the week's events. We still have a, an essence of that, but we have a big picture story every week. And it may not be what's uh, topical at that moment, but it's something that has been topical for quite some time. Maybe something we've never been able to uh, address in a newscast. Mm -hmm. I'll take that issue, we'll dissect it. And of course, we'll have little jokes in between because that's the culture of Trinidad and that Tobago, right? Trinidad and if Tobago. If you keep it too serious, people aren't going to consume it. But if they could laugh and then pause and think, wait a minute, mm -hmm. that's, that's wrong. Yeah. We should probably do something about that now that you've put it that way. That, that's what we're going to accomplish. And, and, and Kwame is an integral part of that because he has his own little segment on the show as well. Right. And um, he, he's, he's brilliant. He's, he's funny. And we have a really nice mix of that journalism and comedy because at the end of the day, it's not satire for satire's sake. Mm -hmm. it's, it's rooted in journalism. It's fueled by journalism. Its philosophy is based in journalism. And there is journalism in it. Yeah. But it's just a different style. But you're going to laugh a bit. Yeah. Uh, I do believe that we have Kwame back here. Kwame, can you hear me now? Yes, I can. 
How does it feel to be part of No Laughing Matter? <laughs> I feel I feel more scared than I'm excited <laughs> um, because this will be this will be the biggest platform I've ever been on. Um, so it's a lot more exposure. But I am excited at the same time. I mean, I couldn't turn on Akash. I can't really turn on a, such a beautiful man, you know? <laughs> <laughs> you know, so can you can you give us a sneak peek into what your segment will look like? Um, the name of my segment, it's Conclusions of the Weeks. Um, I mean, my last name is Weeks. Since I'm in primary school, people making jokes about um, you know, weeks and the months and the days, etc., etc. They wanted to make a little play on on that part of my name, um, and I'm supposed to wrap up uh, the topic of the day, whatever the topic of the day is. Um, I don't want to give too much insight into how it will look exactly, but people should be interested once the show, you know, gets off the ground. Certainly, Akash, I have to ask you. 2020 has been a bumper year. We're, all, we're only midway through it, by the way. Short, no shortage of topics, surely, but, uh, you know, can you tell us some of the topics that you'll be touching on without giving a too much away? Yeah, first, I want to say that I didn't know people used to make fun of his last name, and I've gone and re-victimized him there with <laughs> suggesting that we, we play off his last I name. I am triggered. Thank but, you. Thank you. I'm triggered. I'm triggered. But thanks. <laughs> so, I'm not so, millennial, but... You, I mean, 2020, globally, let's look at it globally. Mm -hmm. We've had the Australian fires. We've had threats of World War III, uh, Kobe Bryant's death, COVID-19. We had the uh, Black Lives uh, Matter movement. And we are in June, where the Mayans are saying that come Sunday, it'll be the end of the world. And I really hope I didn't put all this effort, Kwame and I, for there to be an apocalypse on Sunday when we have, when we have the show. And it's the apocalypse <laughs> at 7.30. Yeah. And then, and then I locally... I'm disappointed, to be honest. I would, I would be you know. really upset, Kwame. So should the apocalypse start at 8 o'clock then? At least. We'll out, talk of to the Mayans. out of Curtis, yeah. <laughs> I'd hate for my face to be the last thing I see before, but... Yeah, I mean, and, and, and then locally we have... So much happening in terms of the, the fiasco with, with this uh, Venezuelan vice president visit. Uh, we have, most importantly now, coming out of COVID, well, coming out, you know, where, where COVID has settled down a bit, we have an election coming up. We have a general election coming up, a very important, uh, uh, you know, a lot of people tend to forget that with all that's happening in Trinidad and Tobago. But it's one thing uh, we aren't short for. Uh, maybe we, we don't get a shortfall for in, in this country. And, and, and it's things to discuss. It's topics like that. It's news. Sure. We don't ever go wanting. There's always something. And when you think, OK, this has been a hectic week so far, sometimes on a Friday, you're like, what? <laughs> really? <laughs> so, so on Sunday, we're going to start off with a really heavy topic. Uh, yes. We're going to discuss. Um, all that's manifested uh, since the, the inception of the uh, latest Black Lives uh, Matter movement. Uh, we're going to look at it from the global scale. Uh, we're going to look at it from a local scale. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, we are seeing a lot of uh, questions. We have a lot of opinion out there. And I think Kwame and I have found a, a very uh, sobering and balanced way to uh, kind of explain how the Black Lives uh, uh, Matter movement matters, but not only in the U.S., but to Trinidad and Tobago as well. Can't wait to see it. Akash, there's one more question left to ask you. Are you ready for this? Kwame, you ready? <laughs> I mean, I guess, I hope, I hope so. <laughs> Mentally, I'm getting there. Uh, with respect to our, our set, I had a, a little peep in just now, and it looks like if the show, it looks like a show that's coming in July, but um, <laughs> I, you know what? If we have to get some carib crates as a desk, we'll be, you know, the, they'll have ready. a show. We'll be ready. We're, we're ready as we could, be, as much as we could be. If you need help carrying those carry crates, let me know. I'll ask Jess. Oh, you. So, <laughs> I was going to suggest Jesse. Okay. Because Jesse can hold. <laughs> <laughs> good one. Good one. Akash Samaru, Kwame Weeks, good luck with the new show. Well, the revamped show in uh, No Laughing Matter. We look forward to seeing it at 7.30 p.m. on Sunday night. We're going to take a quick break here on The Morning Brew. When we come back, The Morning Shot is up next. It's been a hell of a week in sport.